I bought these from eBay from two different sellers, and they came on the same day, amazingly, even though one was bought in auction, and the other was bought Buy It Now. This was Buy It Now, but her hair keeps coming out because I think they messed up on the rooting of this doll. I've never had a problem with my other Generica, which is what I named this type of doll head because they, they have no brand names. Now this doll head, her hair is um, not too rooted despite how fluffy it is, um, but she, she is a blonde with brown eyes. And her hair head, her hair is big and her head is huge. She is more of the live um, size doll. I mean, she's great and she's really pretty. Uh, but I want to do doll interviews. So eventually I'll be buying dolls of people I want to interview. And then having them just, you know, have a phone call and we'll talk over the phone. And then... I will then transcribe that with little interviews with dolls. Now, the, the brunette looks more like me, even though the blonde has more of my hair type and my eye color. The blonde does have my eye color, and I was wondering which one I would use, even though the gen generica might get on my nerves because her hair is not done very well. And... Um, I would like to know which one you should use. I'm going to be doing a little doll makeover on whoever I use, and I'm going to be botting them, not rebotting them because they've never had bodies. So they, these will be more of the custom doll like Generica because Generica did not have a body when I created her. I do like her eyes better, but... So write in the comments which doll you think I should use for doll interviews. And please like and subscribe.